Subscribe or this will happen to you. Yeah, you're not subscribed yet. Come on. We have an email from World's Strongest Man. So it is hot off the press. We've got all the official events um, that we'll be doing at World's Strongest Man. We have to wait uh, 12 hours until we can uh, post about it. So. It's 12 hours, we're posting about it, we're letting you guys know first. Obviously, it's a big, big deal knowing the events a few weeks before, so we can really hone in on them and kind of fine tune um, this next kind of three, four weeks of training. So I think we'll just get stuck in. Happy with that? Mm. I'll do the qualifying and then you can do the finals. Sound okay? Sound okay, guys? So this is the email qualifying round. Each group will compete in six of the qualifying events. So there's actually eight events that they've given us. So they haven't told us what we're going to be um, competing in. So anyway, the first one is the loaded med medley. So it says two elements. There's going to be a frame carry, which is one part, and then loading implements is the other. Implements could include wooden barrels, sacks, anvils, and wooden cartwheels. So again, a loading, loading medley is a loading medley, but they've added a little extra um, dynamic, I guess, because they're putting in a frame carry as well, which we've been training, we've been training loading, we've been training frame carry, so that's two checked off. Fine, fine, fine for us. Event number two is the squat. So it's basically uh, a repeat event um, from 2020. So is that the same as last year, basically, what it's still trying to say? All. Accessory stuffs allowed, dead left, squat suits, knee sleeves, knee wraps, etc. etc. Um, it's on an axle bar, it's the same setup Tom did it, he did nine reps, was it last year? Something like that. Um, so that'll be quite cool. Event three, which is a deadlift, um, so this is going to be a, a rep event uh, as per the squat. Bar height is close to normal dimensions as we have, so just a conventional pool basically. Um, total weight will be between 340 and 350 kilos. Right, wait! So Tom will be hoping for that, yep. I'll be hoping for the squat. Event number four is going to be a train pull. Um, so we've not really thrown that in, but we're going to start the Scott Rail, if you need a train puller, we're your man. So train pull, that's all it is, harness and rope pull. So we don't know the length, we don't know the weight. It'll probably be 20 to 30 metres, it'll be tough. If you're on a copper train track probably, though, where we're climbing up. Mm. So that'll be quite cool, that'll be a good one to do. Event number five in the qualifying is Fingles Fingers. So it'll be, yeah, we, we're covering that. We've got a Fingles Finger now. We're going to be doing that today as well. This is Friday, so this is our events day. And here's the point. I know the Fingle Fingers has got a extra attachment bit on it. But with Fingers, the hardest part is, for me, and probably Luke as well, is when you're walking up with it. I think off the ground for anybody is easy. Yeah. And I like, we could probably do all five just hitting them up on the ground, but it's a walking with it. So mm -hmm. that's the bit we, we're concentrating on, not the start, the walking bit. Yeah, so the smaller diameter pin yeah, is actually a weight loaded, so we can add more weight onto it. So it's, it's just, yeah, it does, it's not going to make any difference to us. Um, so fingers, fingers. The only thing so far we haven't really covered is the train pool, which we'll, we'll get that sorted. Choo -choo! So number. Six is the forward hold, so it's going to be done with a pickaxe. Right, dads, get your pickaxe out. The boys are coming up to the garden. So, so we'll get dad's pickaxe. And um, add some weight to it. So I think it's about 25 kilos um, for max time. So out in front of you, we've been doing that pretty hard. That'd be scary if the pickaxe was facing you. <laughs> Hopefully it won't be. And then oh my number God. This is seven, allergies. overhead medley. So it's a series of implements, which is made up of monster dumbbells, circus barbell, and an axle. So the dumbbell weight, it says 95 kilos 100. to 110 kilos. The circus barbell is between 160 and 175 kilos, and the axle press is close to 163 kilos. We've been training that, I know. Yeah, so just I think we'll just need to incorporate the axle into our training. Yeah, but we can now, because we know now it's not. Yeah. We've got axle after Worlds as well, so it's Yeah, so that's good, actually. That's good. And that's it's not, at least we don't have to do two, all different pressing events now, yeah. but like last year it was log and dumbbell, yeah. it's all at once. So. so we know we've got that covered. They're bringing back the stone off, so um, it's it's basically 
the stone weights will, it says the stone weights will progressively increase beginning with 140 kilos and maxing out at 210. So it'll almost be like a stone one I guess and then I guess the 210 kilo one will be the one determining how many reps you can do with that. So again it's a little bit different from last year and the year before where it was just a one weight stone over and over and over. And then last year was like a, concept, a concession or a, a stone run. It'll be pretty much the same as last year, I guess, won't it? And you're pretty happy with that. No bad for the wee man, eh? So I will pass on the secret email, that's no longer secret, for the final. This is the final events. The final of the World's Strongest Man 2021. Event one, Giants Medley. Two implements, super yoke and frame carry. So the yoke will be roughly 425 or 485. The frame carry will be between 325 and 375. So it'll probably be uh, running with the frame and running with the yoke. It'll be whatever way around. Which we've been doing anyway. That's yeah, right. so yeah, probably 20 meters each way, which is what we've exactly been doing. Mm -hmm. Event two, Titans Turntable. This is a pushing event, so for me this is kind of like the wheel of pain. I think you'll be pushing, you're pushing sitting round in a circle. Mm -hmm. Basically a wheel of pain, but they might add stuff to it. So it's just pushing a circle for as many uh, repetitions as you can. Yo, that would be fun. Yeah, buddy. Everyone will be on the same boat there, that would be hard to train. And then event three, the rain keg toss. This is a uh, maximum height keg. Yeah, keg toss. This is the maximum height keg toss, so it's not, and it's 15 kilograms, so it's who throws a 15 kg keg, the highest wins, basically. And there's only one keg, you don't have to do the keg runs like last year. And then log lift, expect max log. So Ooh. Oh, There's going to be a max log in the final. Um, Who wants to see that 230? Boy! And then we've got something called the NAC deadlift. This is basically just a normal setup deadlift between 350 and 365. I think it's called this because I've been here seeing comments that NAC are now sponsoring World's Strongest Man. So it's going to be set up like a toolbox, toolkit thing. So that'll be quite cool as well. Last but not least, we have the slug run, the Atlas Stones the standard stone series so to be honest the final events this year is basically going back to basics which is quite cool mm -hmm. you know it's got just six basic uh, events that are everyone's kind of strong at <laughs> yeah we're going to go through the events for the final and give our prediction for each event who we think is going to win it yeah. so first event giants medley who's your predictions who's your top three tom stokeman luke stokeman adam bishop the three british beasts we're coming we're going to take that top three so you better watch out I think we'll bash one the yoke last year, so I think that's a good shout. Event two, Titans turntable. Predictions in that. This is hard. Um, I'm just going to say anyone that's in the final. It could be anyone. I'm going to say me for a win in that one. Yeah. I think I, I think I've got the balls to do it, mate. I I I just see what happens. I th I don't know. I'm, I'm excited for that. When I saw that, I'm thinking that's one that. Yeah, it looks good. Mm. It's an unknown as well, it's a bit of an unknown, so for me... I think it's all about if you can just keep going and also if you conserve the amount of energy, you know, you need to push it. I think, I think Big Brian will do quite well on that one as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, let's say, us three and Brian. How about us two and Brian, sorry. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Um, the rain keg toss. Tom Stockman, I think. I'm not being anything, I think but I think I won it last year, I won it this year. we uh, got a statement to make, bro. I think you and Brian will do well on that one. You'll do good. Your keg toss is giving up. Yeah, it's feeling good. Yeah, I, I think we can do well, but yeah, I think you and Brian will have a good battle on that one, to be honest. Event four, the log lift. Max. Oh. Luke Stockman. I, Luke and Graham, I agree. that'll be a great battle. If yeah. Graham gets to the final and Luke gets to the final, that'll be something I think that everybody good. wants to see. Yeah. But I think you'll do well, as I think. I'll do well. I, I know what I'm going to do, but not going to be near the world record, but it'll be cool to see you guys. I think you'll push for top three in that Yeah, it'll be cool to see that. Yeah, definitely. It's just, uh, um, it's just wait and see, boys. is it? The deadlift for reps. So that's, a, that's good for Bishop, Bish. Jeff, Caron. Uh, if, it's a normal, if it's a normal deadlift, but I'd like myself and up there in the top mm. four, top five, so... I think, deadlift, I think, I think Bish, Bish wins it. Yeah, Bish wins. For reps, I think he's the best in the world. Jeff. Jeff. Even Felix, if he's in the final, you know. Yeah. Um, it's a hard one, deadlifts. There's so many strong deadlifters, it's literally one rep to win it. So. And then, event number six, the Atlas Stones. Hmm, I wonder who will win. I don't know. I think 
Tom's in a different league, Tom wins it and then everyone else is just battling it out for that, that kind of second position it could be. You're the second best in the world at the Stones right now. I'll take it, but probably not. Um, Me, you, then, and then somebody else, I don't know. Probably Brian again, Brian's, you know, Brian's got to look at these events and be pretty happy with them, I think. So let's go through it again. So Giants medley, we're saying Ass and Bish, Titans Turntable, Ass and Brian, Rain Kegtosh, you and Brian, Loglift, me and Hixie, Nat Deadlift, you're in the top yeah, five. It's just a very, it can happen anything. Tom's won World's Strongest Man. No, he hasn't. I've won it. That's excited there. Eh? Predictions all done, so. <laughs> Hopefully, we got them right. Hopefully, we'll, yeah. We'll probably be flying back in the qualifying rounds, but. <laughs> if, if everything goes to plan, you know, that's, that's some good events for us. That's some good points. It'd be great to see Bish. The weird thing is, the qualifiers, I think, harder this year than the final. Mm. The way you look at the events, like last year, the final events were harder than the qualifier, but mm. it's the other way around this year. Mm. Like finger fingers, yeah, train pulls, they're all tough yeah, events. Yeah, it's true, actually. Yeah, it's going to be tough. Squat, it, everything's rep in the qualifier, so if you get past that, you're doing good, you know. It's but our, yeah, make the final, and then the final events are really good for us, so we're, we're really excited. Um, same with our fellow Brits as well, get, uh, Adam Bishop. Brilliant event for him. Hitchy, Let's just get all the British guys through to the final. Um, really good. Big Terry as well. You know, Terry's a beast at deadlifting at the moment. His keg toss is good. Big um, Gav Bilton's there as well. Yeah. Big Gav. So hopefully we can get a few of us blitz into the final. It'd be awesome. Um, and uh, yeah, I don't know. What, what are you most looking forward to? See, let's go for the final event. So in the final, we made the final. What's your most exciting event? Um, I'll be looking forward to the log. I like competing at the log lift. I know. I don't want to say stones for me in the back. I'm just, I like to kind of, I like log. I want to see where I am on log press. Mm -hmm. And even just, uh, and also the um, that medley thing as well. So the events are, I just, I'm going to look forward to them. I think it's just a log press. Log press for me, 100%. I think that'll one. be the most exciting yeah. one. No, that's going to be. I think it's going to, yeah, it's going to be a lot of kind of. If everyone, numbers. so if Hicks can go in and shape, if I can go in and shape, um, you, if you can go in shape, we're all looking at. I don't know. A Even few people over two. There's a lot of fun there. Yeah, it could be like Bobby Thompson. If Bobby four, Thompson, five people over two ten, yeah. which would be. Oh, been geez, that's probably the first as well. So I think that'll be an awesome event to mm. see. Um, and then yeah, just just super excited to see everything. I think the list of the final events. I think every event's going to be close mm. and good. It's not going to be like a runaway winner in any mm. of them. Like the keg toss as well. That'll be a good battle. Yeah. Law's going to be a good battle. Deadlift might be a good battle. You know, it's going to be it's going to be really close. I think it will be, so it'll be good. We're going to be... Just excited to get out there again. Yeah. It's been a kind of long, frustrating time as well. Good to get take someone out with us as well, which is going to be yes. good you know, to have someone there with us. And so we've got another email from Worlds actually saying that we can only take one person. guest. So that'll be, you know, our wife's Kush, Kush and Sinead. We'll probably take them. Might take them, yeah. Maybe. See how, see how they behave. So what we'll be doing is the same as last year. We'll be in with our GoPros filming it. Worlds have said you're not allowed to have any videographers at the site. Hopefully that's the We're hopefully, not hopefully we're videographers, yeah. we're athletes. So. Yeah, but hopefully that's the way it will be. We, we need that. Hopefully Worlds will kind of keep to the word with that. And if we're not taking, obviously, Simon. Um, it has to be one rule. Yeah, the then the likes of uh, Eddie, Martins, Brian, none of them guys. We don't want to see anyone else here, because if not, that's kind of a bit unfair on us. But we'll have our GoPros, we'll be filming as much as we can. We'll give you updates whenever we can. It's going to be an awesome show. I think Worlds have put on a great set of events, to be honest. They, they really... Yeah, I was I'm shocked, like I thought they'd maybe try and go out of the box a bit, but they've kept it kind of simple and good mm. for the, good for, it's got to be really good for TV. Yeah. I think everybody that's competing is going to enjoy them, because yeah. well, I'm excited, like when I seen the events, I was like, yeah buddy. <laughs> so Dan's going to kind of tweak our training programmes now for next week, and we're going to be all event specific. Yeah, we had a deload this week, so I'm kind of angry and ready to go, so it's mm. going to be good. Why don't you guys you comment below? Tell us your thoughts on the events, tell us your thoughts if you think the events are good, if they're rubbish, uh, what your predictions are, we want to hear from you. Let us know what you think the overall positions will be. And if you guess it right, you don't want anything, but well, you guess it right, so that's all. We're well, ready right, to right, Simon for the day. There we go. He'll paint his nails straight. Stay safe, smile, and stay spicy, guys. And keep ringing that little bell. Ding -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling.